I've been a communications officer for the State Patrol for 24 years, two months, and a few days. I have worked as a communications officer for five and a half months now. As a dispatcher, we are answering all the calls, public and 911 lines. We also dispatch for all of our troopers, so they call out their traffic stops, and we also are communicating with Fish and Wildlife, Forest Services, Department of Natural Resources, and park rangers. I think I help the troopers do their job by being a positive voice on the other end of the radio, and whenever they need assistance, I'm there to help them as best I can, whether it's um, giving them driver's checks, getting a tow truck to a scene, aid to a scene, more troopers to a scene. <laughs> I had one call where this wife and husband and their, I believe, two-year-old child were in the car and somebody pointed a weapon at them. And I was able to reassure them that yes, we have advised our troopers and our troopers were able to make contact with the subject that did this. So that gave them a sense that we were there on the road and we were assisting them. This couple was stuck in their truck on the beach and they were in the surf and the, the tide was in. They were in the back seat of their truck because the front of it had filled up with water. And she was totally hysterical. And so I kept them on the line trying to get them to get out, get out of the truck so that they wouldn't go out to sea with their truck. <laughs> the local police department was able to get there and aid and everybody to get them rescued. I think I made a difference with that because I was the calm voice on the other end of the phone. Oftentimes, you have a lot riding on you at once, so you have to be able to be outgoing and confident in what you are doing and about your training to be able to assist the troopers, and you have to be able to handle five things at once. I think a successful communications officer is someone who has a positive attitude, um, can look at the glass half full, because um, it can be, it's a very serious job, and sometimes that can drag you down a little bit, and. So I think that when you have a positive attitude, it helps um, get you through the day. It's a fulfilling job. You're there to help the public, a bright light on the other end of the radio, or the other end of the phone. It gives you a sense of worth at the end of the day. Every day I get to come in and do something new for the community. I'm helping my troopers, I'm helping the public. You're getting a voice that you can't put a face to. You're getting a voice to, I'm in this situation that is terrible and I need help now and I get to be the one that helps them get anything they need. So it's very fulfilling. <laughs>